longer in search. On today's program, we shall take a cursory look at these different interpretations of the ruling, both from the senator's lawyer and the NDLEA. Sit back, please don't go anywhere. I'll be back after this short break. That was the document I went to give to the man I see over yesterday. Okay. After his ordeal in June 2015 in the hands of the operatives of the Drug Law Enforcement Agency for about six days, in which they laid a siege in his legal home to arrest him, the case has once again resurfaced. The senator subsequently succeeded in getting different Nigerian courts from the Australian NDLA from arresting and extraditing him to the United States. A federal high court in Lagos lifted the siege on Senator-elect Kachanu's home as he was then. Justice Ibrahim Kuba ordered the Attorney General of the Federation, the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, not to take any further action to extradite Senator Kachanu to the United States. Paper. I want to print that on the table here. Paper, she want to clean it. You know, print, copy, copy. Okay, whatever. Seeking to arrest an extradite and extradite the Kachamu to the United States. I quote: The suit is hereby dismissed. There shall be no order as to cost. The applicant being an office created by the Constitution in Section 150, Subsection 1 of the Constitution 1999 as amended. To do otherwise is to further deepen an incipient culture of disobedience of court orders and of unmitigated acts of unbridled impunity in the even uh, by the city. No, give this to Charles Boy. Look at the way, look at the way he's reading the topic. Give this to, to Charles Boy, to uh, Suleiman, or you give it to Sheo Fi or Kimbalo. Look at the way we present it. Meanwhile, the victim and his lawyer provide a tactical food there. So, the studies, would they like to pay the country? There is a way to suggest this sort of thing. For NDLA, the U.S. appeal court has strengthened their resolve to reopen the extradition move on the open state senator. I spoke with the agency spokesman, Michelle Okoyedu, on their next plan. Hello. Um, we understand that uh, NDLA has started making moves concerning the extradition. What exactly do you understand? By the ruling of the United States concerning the Senator Kajamu. That's not the first question. First of all, let me say we have been in court over this uh, process. We instituted the extradition, uh, you know, case against him, and he went to court to seek an injunction restraining us from uh, arresting him. So that. Uh, because uh, Senator Kachamu's lawyer believes that uh, that particular ruling is misinterpreted, that the, the, the ruling does not empower anyone to extradite him.
it, but you, you are quoted to have said that the ruling has strengthened and emboldened you. Can you explain these two words? Uh, what, what I mean is that that ruling has strengthened our argument in vacating the other restraining us. Okay. Yeah, so we have uh, a memorandum of understanding with the, with the United States. Mm. It is a tradition. But we, we are going to use the next. I didn't like that. concern that uh, does he have to take a foreign court to embolden you or gives you the go ahead when about three courts according to uh, uh, Senator Kajamu's lawyer, about three courts have restricted you or restrained you from arresting his client yes, that's exactly what I said that we are in court okay, okay? and we are driving this process legally Thank you very much for your time. For Senator's lawyer, Mr. Akibola Puliedi, the ruling by the U.S. appeal court is misinterpreted by a section of the media. I also spoke with him on the matter. Hello, Mr. Puliedi. Let me start by asking you what exactly do you mean by misinformation by a section of the media concerning the appeal court ruling in the United States. Yes, because the impression that the media has created is that uh, the case was a case that Dr. Sham perhaps he was the one who initiated it himself. And that was the information. The second is the impression was given that it concerned
Okay. 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 Yeah. One of the things they said is that the actions are ongoing to facilitate orders restraining the, 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 the NDLEA from uh, carrying out the arrest. So, are you aware of this action? Having said all these, uh, in few words, can you just make it clear what that ruling says and what should Nigeria know in a very simple language to all Nigerians on what is Everything that is just around. 
Thank you very much. Just like Ebola Oluyede, thank you for your time.